Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a drop 10 before summer update and this is the last update before the finale and that is in a month which is quite insane to be quite honest. I wouldn't say this is a successful project pan because I do have an empty a few actually but there are definitely some products that I can't finish but I really wanted to do this project just to do the project because I have done it the last two times. This project is created by Amanda and Jessica from the Fantastic Ladies and again as I said it has been here two times before so it was created in 2017. It was the product that project that started the whole Fantastic Ladies thing which is quite amazing to me so we have come we have come very far since the first project. So again I wanted to do it for nostalgia. Yeah. Let's get some coffee and then we can talk about the empties that I have for this update. Okay. The first one is no surprise, it is the Goof Proof Brow Pencil from Benefit. It is looking like this if you haven't seen it before. So it has this teardrop shape to it and in the other end there is a brush, which I really really liked. I really really love this eyebrow pencil but I have just realized that in general, I'm just more of a brow powder girl. I'm not going to buy products that aren't cruelty free anymore, so I can't buy this product if I really wanted to, so I feel fine. Then I have my W7 Got It Covered Concealer Palette, and I was working on two concealers in this palette. It was these two up here in the top, and as you can see, I have finished them, or oh, I'm almost done with the uh, corrector. I've just de it into another pan, so I don't have to have this out because these two concealers are a bit too dark for me still, so I'm just waiting for a tan to get here <laughs> so I can work on the rest of the palette. The cream blush I have from the Balm from Joey palette, it is this bright red one. I wanted to have a pan on it. It has a quite a good dip in it now. Yeah, you can kind of see the dip there. So maybe I can pan. The pan is not that deep. Maybe it is a little bit. This is a lip and cheek blush thing. So you can use it on your lips as well. I have thought about when I wear a red lipstick, I can wear this at the beginning of the day and then touch up with the other one. So maybe I can pan on it that way and maybe go through it faster because you don't need a lot when it is a red cream blush. I use it after my primer and before my foundation. So it still shines through, but it's not as bright red. So I really, really enjoy using this blush. Hopefully it is the last cream blush in my collection. <laughs> because I don't want to have any cream blush. So that's exciting. Then I have the Imite Makeup Lip and Cheek Stain. I only use this on my lips, but I will be honest and say I haven't used it that much. I could mark it again today, so this is two months of progress. Again, I haven't really used it, but it is going down, which is nice. I do like it, I just don't have it in my routine to apply it as the first thing. I have got it into a routine to use a lip balm every single day, and now I just need to get this into my routine. But I really don't mind this going slow. I don't need it in my collection, let's say it like that. At some point it will be done. This product is the W7 Jelly Crush Lip Scrub. I finally used the... Oh my god, my nose is running. I'm sorry. That is disgusting. I finally finished the lip scrub I had in my 19 and 19 project pan. So I have finally begun to use this. It's not that different from the intro picture because I've only used it like once or twice. So yeah, that's it. Um, I don't think I can hit pan on this because it took me a few months to hit pan on in the last one I had. But I will still try because now this is my main focus for a lip scrub. Um, yeah, I, I can't say anything about it because I know I won't finish it and I don't have the highest hope about hitting pan on that. And if you wanted to see how much I had of my Goof Proof in the beginning, I was up to there, last update, and now I have finished it. So, let's take my foundation. It is the W7 Face Fantasy Matte Finish Foundation. This one right here. It is a pale, pale shade that is actually too light for me now. So I am mixing it with the shade that is a 
bit darker than this and that is matching me perfectly i do have it on today so i really really like this foundation i would also like to have it done because i'm a little bit over matte foundation even though i really really like this one so i am down to here so i think i can finish it by the finale because i only have that much left so as you can see in my progress it's very steady throughout the two last months maybe it's going to be a little bit slower Maybe it will be a stretch because I am mixing it, but again, I will do my best. I finally have a marking on my W7 Lives at Beach Beach Body Contour Sculpting Body Cream. It is this one and it is a shimmery body thing and I have a new marking. I hold it up to the light and I could finally see some progress. I have used it today on my arms. I don't know if you can see the shine. This is really awkward. I have used it a few times this past month, nothing major. I don't want to use it on a daily basis, basically. And the weather is crap again. Yeah, I don't have anything to say about the weather. <laughs> the last product is my shower gel from Yves Rosé. It is the Raspberry and Peppermint shower gel. It is this one. It smells really, really nice. I am getting used to the scent, so that's nice. I am halfway through the product now i am down to there so last update i was there and i started up here oh the reflection i'm sorry my nose is running that is so disgusting but i am really liking this one i cannot finish this by the next update but i'm really happy that i got halfway through it the progress is not as good as last month because i am using a little bit less of it because sometimes i feel like i'm wasting it and i don't want to waste product i want to use it naturally and yeah, so I'm just going to use the amount I think I need to use. So, And I use it on a puffy thingy, so you don't need a lot when you do that. If I want to have it done by the finale, I can ask my boyfriend to use this also. But I'm not in a rush or anything. That was everything for this update. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, give it a like, subscribe down below if you haven't already to become a part of this small family that I'm growing here on YouTube. I am really excited that we have, are so many people now. So I hope you guys want to be a part if you aren't already. And until my next video, please take care.